Hello, I'm back. I don't know what is going on with my phone, but I cannot seem to record a video for nothing. It keeps deleting it, or it keeps running out of storage, and I've got to go to bed. It is 1046. It was Mother's Day. Um, I'm saying this again for like the fifth time. Um, we went to my parents' house. We went to church, and then we went to my parents' house. We had roast, and we had cake. It was really yummy. And then we came home. Me and the girls decided to walk over to um, Starbucks. Well, 7-Eleven and then Starbucks. And then there's this place right next to Starbucks called Cookie Monster. And you'd think they'd sold cookies, but they don't. They sell ice cream. Ten bucks for two ice cream cones. Oh, and they charge you for the cone. I don't know about that. And their ice cream? It was okay. It was good. I mean, it was nothing to write home about. It wasn't right. I mean, it wasn't thrifty ice cream, so it wasn't nothing to write home about. It wasn't $10 worth of good, but you know. And then uh, the girls were doing their thing, and I was watching... American Crime Story, the O.J. Uh, People vs. O.J. Simpson. I mean, I've always been kind of interested in that because I lived through it. Um, I was in my early 20s when that was going on, and I remember watching a lot of the trial with my dad, and I was convinced he was guilty. I mean, I was convinced they would find him guilty. Every ounce of evidence, point, almost every ounce of evidence, pointed to him being guilty. Cato Kalin's statement. The problem with Cato Kalin, though, is he couldn't keep his crap together. He was so out of it, and he didn't really know... <laughs> what was going on. He just said, I heard banging noises and footsteps. That could have been anybody, you know, which is what the defendants, the defense said. Could have been anybody. But anyway, I've only watched the first part of it, and I'm sure it's like in three different parts. And, um, but it was interesting because I forgot that the evidence against OJ was obtained illegally. The glove, the blood drops, and all of that that they obtained, they obtained at his residence. No warrant, no cause, nothing. They went there to, to advise him or to let him know that his wife was dead. That was what they, or his ex-wife was dead. That's what they said. The first place they went wasn't to Nicole Simpson's family, or Nicole Brown Simpson's family. The first place they went was to OJ. They jumped his fence. They had no warrant, no cause to search his house. No cause to search his house or his grounds or anything, but yeah, they did. And all the evidence that they had pointed to him being the killer, the absolute killer, but couldn't use it. Completely inadmissible. <laughs> crazy but um anyway it's just an interesting story it's it's you know especially since it's been more than 20 years since that happened it's you know I personally think he did it I've always thought he did it um and if he didn't do it for some reason he knew about it he had it done or he had an accomplice I mean it's hard to imagine him killing two people like that by himself but I suppose he could have if he took Ron out first he could have went right after Nicole if she like froze in terror I mean it was no indication she even tried to run back in the house I mean nobody really knows what happened except the person who killed him um, whether that's OJ or somebody that OJ hired or whoever. But, uh, anyway, I gotta go. It's late. This video's gonna be super, super short. I was gonna watch my sister's video, but I think I'll have to do that tomorrow morning. I don't know. I was gonna watch, like I said, watch my sister's video, but I'll do that in the morning because my phone keeps just cutting out on me. And I had some cute stuff I wanted to add to my... Okay. I'll try this again. I had to delete a few things off. I don't know how much time I'm going to have left, so I'm not going to have OJ no more. <laughs> I was going to say, I had a good Mother's Day. hope everybody had a good Mother's Day. It's going to be a very short video because I only recorded like three minutes of the first one. And this one, I don't know how much longer it's going to have on here. I had to take a map off and see if that helps. Through. I'm supposed to have more data than that. I'm not data, but more storage, but I guess not. I don't think I got as much storage as I could have. I wonder if I can add more to it. I don't know if you can do that if you have to just get a whole different phone. I don't know. I just need to get a better camera. An actual vlogging camera would be nice. But those are kind of pricey. So, anyway, I'm really going to go ahead and set off this time. Hope everybody had a really great Mother's Day, and I will see you all later. Hopefully, I can record more tomorrow. Bye bye.